The hackers are back. On March 17, 2022, Credit Peru, a trans union, released a statement saying it had been hacked and that 54 million South African records were under potential threat as a result. Subsequent reports stated the data loss were a result of an earlier hack, but the fact remains. Every company that holds personal information is a potential target and credit bureaus in particular appear to be easy pickings. One of the biggest problems is that although credit unions take considerable precautions to safeguard their customers against these kind of attacks, there are incidents that prove impossible to defend themselves against. Why? Because they simply don't know what they don't know, and you can't protect yourself from what you don't know. Psychologists tell us we humans have unexpected gaps in our knowledge that leave us vulnerable. But how do these types of cognitive barriers play out in the credit and finance sectors? Credit bureaus have certain parameters in which they operate and specific information they require. If fraudsters know exactly what credit bureaus are looking for and can present it in a way that looks believable, the chances are they will be believed. When you hide in plain sight something people don't expect to see, the chances are they won't see it. We explore this further in our next article, What do a gorilla and your sensitive data have in common? My name is Gordon van Beek from JGL Forensic Services and thank you for listening. If you have not read the full article entitled, The Hackers Are Back, then please click on the link below to access the article. We would really like to hear your thoughts on this article and what you think we should do to build a South Africa that we can all be proud of. Thank you, stay safe and God bless.